On November 26, 2024, the U.S. Marine Corps took a major step forward in enhancing its sea denial capabilities with a formal induction of the Navy Marine Expeditionary Ship Interdiction System, MESIS. The milestone event took place at Marine Corps Base Hawaii, where the 3D Marine Littoral Regiment, MLR, officially became the first U.S. military unit to field this advanced ground-based anti-ship missile system. The ceremony, held at Dewey Square, was attended by distinguished military officials and international partners, marking the successful integration of MESIS into Marine Corps operations. MESIS represents a significant upgrade to the Marine Corps' ability to counter maritime threats. Built around the U.S. Navy's Advanced Naval Strike Missile, NSM, MESIS provides a mobile, precision-guided missile system with an impressive range of approximately 185 kilometers, 100 nautical miles. This long-range capability allows the Marines to strike enemy vessels well beyond the horizon, a critical advantage in the vast Indo-Pacific region where naval engagements often take place at considerable distances. As Lieutenant Colonel Timothy W. Love, Commanding Officer of the 3D Littoral Combat Team, LCT, noted, the system enhances the regiment's role in naval campaigns. In addition to rifle companies capable of seizing and defending key maritime terrain, 3D LCT's missile battery is now armed with mobile precision fire systems to support sea denial operations, he stated. The MESIS system equips the 3D LCT with the ability to conduct effective strikes against naval targets, adding a critical layer to the Marine Corps sea denial strategy. The NSM, the core component of MESIS, is designed for precision and stealth. It incorporates GPS guidance and an infrared homing system to accurately target enemy ships. The missile's low radar cross-section and ability to fly at sea-skimming altitudes make it difficult for enemy radar systems to detect and intercept, giving it a significant edge in modern naval warfare. This stealth capability is vital for striking a range of targets, from large warships to smaller, faster vessels. The NSM's low observable flight profile means it can approach enemy vessels undetected until the final stages of its attack, dramatically improving the chances of a successful strike, even against well-defended targets. One of the standout features of the MESIS is its mobility. The missile launchers are transportable and can be rapidly redeployed to various locations, a crucial advantage in littoral and expeditionary operations. This ability to adapt to dynamic battlefield conditions is essential for the Marines, who often operate in rapidly changing environments. The system's flexibility allows it to integrate seamlessly into Marine Air Ground Task Force, MAGTF operations, enabling precise long-range strikes during maritime operations. Moreover, MESIS enhances the survivability of Marine Corps units in hostile environments. Its stealth features allow it to evade detection by advanced air defense systems, making it a formidable tool against modern interception technologies. This high survivability rate ensures that MESIS remains effective even in highly contested operational areas. The integration of MESIS into the 3D Marine Littoral Regiment, MLR, is a strategic enhancement for U.S. forces in the Indo-Pacific region. The regiment, based in Hawaii, is specialized in amphibious and littoral warfare operations and plays a key role in ensuring the security and stability of this vital region. With the addition of MESIS, the MLR is better equipped to confront maritime threats, contributing to regional security and supporting joint operations with U.S. allies. The operational capacity of the 3D MLR has been significantly bolstered by this addition. Marines in the regiment's Fire Support Coordination Center will oversee the integration of MESIS into joint and allied operations, utilizing maritime and air domain awareness for precise targeting decisions. The system's incorporation into the broader maritime dynamic targeting process ensures that U.S. and allied forces can carry out timely and accurate strikes on hostile maritime targets. The delivery of MESIS to the 3D MLR follows months of rigorous testing and operational evaluation. Colonel John G. Lehane, commanding officer of 3D MLR, emphasized the system's importance, moving the MESIS from the category of initial test and operational evaluation to a fielded weapon system is a significant milestone for 3D MLR. He further highlighted that MESIS enhances the regiment's sea denial capabilities, playing a crucial role in supporting the Marine Corps' mission to attack enemy maritime targets. The U.S. Marine Corps' adoption of MESIS signals a shift toward agile, mobile, and precision strike capabilities that deny adversaries control over maritime spaces. By incorporating advanced technology like MESIS, the Marine Corps is positioning itself as a leader in modern warfare, ensuring its ability to respond effectively to maritime threats in the evolving security landscape of the Indo-Pacific. The successful fielding of MESIS marks a major achievement for the U.S. Marine Corps, 
enhancing its maritime strike capabilities and providing a powerful tool for sea denial. This system not only improves the 3D Marine Littoral Regiment's effectiveness in countering maritime threats, but also strengthens the U.S. military's broader strategic posture in the Indo-Pacific region. With the integration of advanced systems like MESIS, the Marine Corps is better equipped to meet the challenges of modern warfare, ensuring a robust defense against maritime adversaries in an increasingly complex security environment. Thank you.